Hello, friends. Where is the International Space Station right now? Who's on board right now? Can we see what's going on up there right now? The answers are yes, yes, and yes. And you probably already knew this because we all love everything about space and the International Space Station. So in this free Udemy class, I'm going to show you how to locate the ISS in space in real time using a using Python and a REST API call. So REST API is nothing more than a function, the same type of function you'd call using any other programming language, except that function lives on the internet. So that's really cool. That means you could be on the beach, you could use your phone, dial up, uh, you know, that REST API and get all the information you need while you're there sitting on the, on the sand. It's that awesome. We'll also use our REST API to find out exactly who is on board the ISS right now. Remember, the ISS has a crew at all times. It's pretty crazy. It's like this big floating bus, 200 miles high, with uh, antennas and solar panels all protruding out. It's orbiting around the Earth 15 times per day, and in it are astronauts from all around the world conducting scientific experiments. I mean, this is straight out of a science fiction movie. I love it. So my name is Manuel Amunategui, and you may know me from as the, the host of the Viral ML Show. Uh, and also, by the way, please sign up for my newsletter. It's right there in the middle of the page so you can be part of this community. And also, please review the class. Let me know how I'm doing. Give me feedback because I want to make sure that you know I'm spending my time the right way. I want to keep creating free classes to teach data science, to teach machine, to teach machine learning to anybody from around the world at no cost because I want to make sure everybody gets that opportunity. I think it's phenomenal. I love this field and I want to make sure everybody gets a taste of it. So let me outline what we're going to do in this class so you know all the cool things you're going to learn. We'll start by getting the names of the astronauts on board right now up there. Uh, and then we're going to get the real time location of the station and plot it on a great looking map that outlines each continent uh, so we can quickly tell where uh, the station is. Then we'll kick it up a few notches. We'll create a data collecting function. Let me show you what that looks like. Here is one. Basically, I ran it for almost, you know, almost two hours. And you can see I've plotted it when we can see exactly where the station is. And you can run it however long you want. You can run it for a few hours and you'll start getting these really cool designs. Remember, uh, in data science, data is critical. It's just like uh, fuel to a rocket. Uh, without data, there's not much data science. And then we'll dig, uh, we'll use some of this data that we collected, and we'll start looking at machine learning. We're going to create two simple, very simple models. Nothing scary going on here. We'll start with a linear regression, so we can try to predict where the space station will be in the next 10 minutes. And then we'll look at a slightly more complex model that's better at mapping nonlinear trajectories. Uh, again, nothing scary. Uh, we'll then move all everything we've learned, we're then going to move that to the internet. The real internet, we're going to move it to the cloud. We're going to use a great free uh, provider called Python Anywhere. And there, you will be able to, to locate, we'll create an application, a real web application. Let me show you what it looks like. It's so much fun. And you'll be able to locate exactly where the, the, the space station is in real time. Here it is, right? Hopefully you can see it. I'm going to push the button. And in it, you should see the space station appear. There you go. It is that cool. This basically just looks exactly like you would have, you know, uh, on uh, the, the Google Play Store, the Apple App Store, right? It looks exactly the same, except it's a web application. So it will look good on your phone. It's going to look good on a tablet. It'll look good on a, on a desktop computer. We'll use Chart.js to outline uh, the, the globe. And we're going to, on top of it, we're going to map an image of the space station. You're going to see it's a lot of fun. Uh, we'll also add a button so we can get live access, live feed uh, of what's going on on the ISS right now. That's a lot of fun. So I'm really excited about this. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun, but I do expect a few things out of you. I do expect that you know the basics of Python, like running a Jupyter Notebook, like uh, pip installing uh, libraries and also importing them, right? These are the basics that you should have already before you take the class, because I'm not going to cover these. You don't have to know anything about statistics, about Flask, about, um, you know, about machine learning because we're going to keep things simple and I'll cover that in this class. And also the source code is right there. So you have a link and the source code will be there so you can just follow along as I am, you know, kind of walking you through it. So astronauts, climb on board and let's have some fun.